Hi everyone, uh, I'm Ellen Cummings, a content writer at Professional Beauty. Thank you for joining us for today's webinar, which is all about why every salon should offer plasma. And this webinar is supported by Artemis, um, who will be providing the opportunity to apply for a free trial of the Plazon device, which is going to be mentioned in the webinar. So we're gonna drop a link into the Facebook comments section, which will take you to the application form. So today's webinar is presented by Andrew Hansford, who is an educator and treatment development specialist with over 15 years experience in the aesthetics and beauty industries. And he's also the founder and director of ACH Aesthetics. Hi, Andrew, thanks for joining us. Hi, Ellen, thank you, it's a pleasure. All right, so before I hand over to Andrew to get started, if you are watching this webinar live and you have any questions for Andrew, um, if you're in the Zoom webinar platform, we're gonna run the Q&A via the Facebook comments. So if you've got any questions at all for Andrew, if you put your question in the Facebook comments section for the webinar when that comes up, um, and then he'll go back and answer it for you then. So if everyone's ready, we'll get started. Andrew started his sharing his screen. So yep, we're all good to go. Amazing. Thank you again, Emma. Um, so thank you so much for joining me this morning. Uh, to talk about this cold plasma technology. It really is uh, an incredible um, device and also concept, um, which is uh, really very, very exciting. Very exciting for me, uh, the company as a whole. And I think you're going to get some um, really, get really quite excited about the, the possibilities um, with this particular um, device due to the uh, the amount of possibilities that, that it's capable of doing. So, um, as we just said, well, we will be at Professional Beauty, so I'm really excited about that. I'll be flying around like a crazy person as usual, but there will be um, lots of opportunities to ask more questions um, if you need to or would like to have a demonstration or be a model. Um, you can absolutely do that by contacting Kelly. Those details will be at the end, um, but please come and see us on the stand as well and have a, have a bit of a chat and actually see, see it in action. So basic, in a, in a nutshell, what does it actually do? Um, so what we're looking for here is the understanding around the plasma technology. And this is cold plasma, not hot. Hot is a very different um, indication. Um, I'm sure many of you know what, what that is, amazing treatment, but it's a different thing altogether. This is cold plasma. So the research and study behind this particular um, application and device is uh, extremely extensive. I mean, um, culminating in its FDA approval. So it destroys bacteria, it's anti-inflammatory. It sterilizes the skin. It has anti-pigment effect to suppress melanin production. It increases collagen remodeling. It was, has a reduction in oil production up to 25%. And the all of those things are incredible, of course, but the transdermal drug delivery system is absolutely amazing. Um, the indications we can do as a standalone. So as a standalone treatment using the plasma side, the cold plasma side, we have an ability for collagen remodeling, skin re regeneration, sebum production and, and reduction, wound healing and incre increasing of our dermal density. So that helps with all acneic skin. Then we have the ability of transdermal delivery, which is various substances like HAs, vitamins, serums, um, PRP, uh, which will give us improvements in melasma, cellulite, contact dermatitis, eczema, rosacea, and psoriasis. And that's just the tip of the iceberg. <laughs> to be honest, there's so much more to discover and it's happening all the time. So plasma itself, I'm sure some of you know, it's the full state of matter. So we go from solid, liquid, gas, plasma. And plasma is the last state of matter and we have 99.999% of the world is surrounded by plasma. So to harness the power of this is really quite incredible and in, in, it has to be done correctly, hence the amount of trials and backstory that goes into the application of this um, device. On the skin itself, from the cold plasma perspective, what it will do, is on the skin surface, it will help to kill germs and bacteria by breaking the bacterial molecular structure. In the epidermis, it dramatically increases the absorption rate by temporarily breaking the cell adhesion molecules. And in the dermis, it tightens by balancing the membrane's potential. 
and it also stimulates the regeneration of collagen and fibroblasts by the stimulation of water molecules and increasing heat and friction. So it works on all layers of the skin. That's a fabulous picture of plasma. The method of action is Sterilization is the starting point. So with the plasma handpiece itself, it will absolutely sterilize the surface of the skin and help to open the skin's barrier. We then ha have a transdermal delivery, which then allows the product to internally go into the skin deeper. We have sauna preparation, which we have then to actually allow the contraction of collagen, the reformation of collagen, and to push any products that you are using on the skin deeper, and then ending up with the regeneration, tightening, and the effects of whatever you are trying to, trying to treat at that particular time. As we stated, there's various modalities you can use in relationship to what condition you are looking um, to, to treat. The solar operation side of it is actually focused ultrasound. So focused ultrasound is very proven. We understand its concept. We understand how amazing it is for the skin. It will absolutely help to increase the fluid of, um, the flow of fluid, I'm sorry, into the cell's natural environment, into the, the matrix itself. We know that it can help uh, the products enter through cell walls. We've seen the, the um, evidence of that. The difference of depths also relates to, so we know we have one, three, and 10 megahertz of, of relationship of depth into the skin, three megahertz being the most optimum, and this is the one that we will use. This in turn helps to stimulate the fibroblast, it enhances the skin's elasticity through the, the massaging effect of it itself. It also helps to discharge melanin and impurities from the skin. It increases the cell absorption, again, and the product delivery by using stable ultrasound. As I said, three megahertz is the um, depth of choice. Clinical studies, why would you do use anything that doesn't come with a background of clinical studies? And cold plasma itself has a lot of clinical studies. Cold plasma and this, this device specifically um, has an awful lot of clinical studies. And I say this to a lot of people, if you're ever going to invest in a product or a device, this is the first thing you should ask for, or the clinical studies. Internal studies are fabulous, of course, they're doing their due diligence, they're testing out the, the, the product or the device itself, but external studies are very, very important because it means they are completely unbiased. And all of these studies are externally given. And there was one in particular, it looks quite confusing there, but there is one in particular, um, it's a very recent study, which talks about um, cold plasma in relationship to the ecadrin. And that ecadrin is basically a cell to cell, not a many cell to cell adhesion molecules. And that they play a massive role at epithelial cell behavior and formation. And they help to bind and maintain the dermal structure. Um, this has proven that these can be broken or contracted to allow product implantation. And that's the part that, what, that, that we get so excited about knowing that we can actually get this into the deeper layers of the skin. So the, the areas that we can work on, as we said earlier, the first one is the antibacterial effect and the sterilization. So by association, that is absolutely gonna help killing any C acne bacteria by sterilizing the skin, it has a massive anti-inflammatory effect and will reduce sebum production. And this one can be done literally as a standalone. You can also use this pre any treatment you are going to do that may have a traumatic response. So if you're doing needling, you want to make sure that that skin is absolutely sterilized and clean or bacteria removed. You can do this, it takes a matter of minutes to do, the, to do this prior to you then undertaking something like a microneedling treatment. The plasma anti-pigmentation and brightening. So this helps by decreasing the melanin production. And it can be amplified if you are using a whitening solution at all. Because um, obviously that's gonna go into a deeper layer because when we're looking at pigmentation, it could be from superficial down to dermal. 
The regeneration side or the tightening we're using is a combination with both hand pieces in this instance. So we can then use the plasma to as a good antibacterial to open the pathway for any product implantation. We can also use the perforation side of it to help to tighten and stimulate the collagenesis from a deeper level. The absorption, so transdermal drug delivery. Now this is, as I've stated, extremely important when it comes to your clients, when you're looking at what do I need to do? How do I need to treat this? How can I get the product of choice into to the area of concern? So we know that superficial application can only do so much, um, apart from very strong actives, but we need to get, some, on many occasions, we need to get deeper. So this will actually allow us to target and tailor every single treatment, meaning that the treatments you're delivering in clinic will be completely bespoke. So you have the base, the reality, the initial reality of the antibacterial um, side of the coin, opening up the, the, the channels, etc. And then we're going, okay, what are we going to do now? What can we use? And then you have a choice of ingredients and products. And believe me, most things you will get through the skin. It's pretty incredible how much you can get into the skin. Now, as an FYI here, the one thing I would, I don't even suggest, it's mandatory, um, is to use a product that has a registration for injection. You wouldn't put a non C, put, you wouldn't inject a non C product into the skin. Why would you do that with this? So, any mesotherapy cocktail, biovitalization bio cocktails, um, hyaluronic acid, all of which should have a registration for injection. So you know that you're going to, because it will, it will disappear inside the skin. And that's why I think it would be so marvelous for you to come and see it actually happening on stand. And, and it, it really is quite incredible when you see it happening. But that also means that you can then so much easier easily target the areas you're looking for, whether it be hydration, would be HA, of course. It Will it be something that you've got pigmentation, um, you know, fine lines and wrinkles, all the different things that mesotherapy is so incredible for, you can actually get it into the skin, but everywhere. So it's more, even more spread out. These are some incredible photographs. So this is two treatments into it. So this is obviously acne of acne, and, and you can see by the treatment that the um, it's broken down a lot of the bacterial, and that is one week after the second treatment. Same thing, so this is four treatment, one treatments one week apart. And you can see that also the good thing here is that the acne is reduced absolutely, but so is the inflammation, which is so, so important when it comes to inflammatory acne. This is skin quality. So this is really a, your mainstay, your go-to that we can target. Look at the eye. You've got the eye on the left and you've got full face on the right. And you can see the full face on the right where the pigment has been reduced. The skin is much more even. It looks more tonal. Um, and actually what they call it, um, the um, airbrush facial, which um, is hilarious considering like all the all the airbrush apps that we have out there but it absolutely is i've done it to myself and it was quite incredible the after effects because you are placing this much product into the skin and we're talking a lot so it's in the skin that gives you this instant gratification and obviously we want regenerative long-term results and that's absolutely what this is for but you do get that incredible instant gratification with the product that's in that's been in absorbed into the skin and you do look like you've been airbrushed. These are single treatments as you can see on the neck. Amazing results. So what we're looking at is the ability for us to be able to use a single device in multiple ways. So we know that we can look at the acneic side of the skin, which so as we all know, at times can be very difficult to treat and it will take mul um, multiple um, treatment options to be able to get to that end point. And there are, there are situations you do need to look after the skin. You do need to make sure there's perfect home care. You do need to know, make sure their diet and everything else is, is, is you know, up to scratch. So it's working together, but this will absolutely give you that kickstart by, by calming down that old production, because obviously that's what the, the ultimate goal 
to calm down that ulcer, the, the oil production, to calm down at the, the overstimulated skin and uh, kill off all of that bacteria. You can do it on multiple treatments. So you don't have to do it every week, two weeks. You can do it a, new, a couple of, two or three times in the same week to bring it down. And also, which is unbelievable, as far as I'm aware, it's the only treatment that you can do if they are on oral or topical retinoids, um, which as we all know, is very, very, is, is not allowed in, in most treatments. So Raccutane, you can absolutely do it. Um, the intervention behind pure plasma and cold plasma especially has been so well studied, hence why the device has, has, managed, has got its um, CE medical device, FDA approval, all of those things. And the company are amazing in the fact that they will open this up to you. You can read them all, you can have them all, we can talk about it all, you can understand how it works, because obviously I've, I've, I've touched on the surface of how cold plasma um, works in collaboration with the ecadrin and the cell to cell adhesion molecules. It is a lot more complex than that, but it's very interesting as well. And so without question, we can help and support and I can talk you through that. So with the implantation from all the different layers of the skin, it's extremely relevant when it comes to the growth factor responsibilities for all the different layers of the skin. So obviously in the, in the epidermis, you've got the keratin site and epidermal growth factors, which are responsible for thickening of the epidermis and cell to cell communication. So that's phenomenal from a superficial perspective, but as we're getting deeper, we're looking at more things like deeper hydration and deeper pigmentation as well. You can combine this with any treatment you are currently doing. It's completely safe to do before any treatment you are doing. And as I said, you can use it for any medication you, you may be on at the time. So that was quite a short and sweet. Um, the company, and you will also see on the stand that they are, they are offering also another device, which is cryoslimming and cryotoning, which is, amazing as well so it's definitely something that you should um take a look at um when you when you come to the stand but if you want any information whatsoever the website is there please take a screenshot of it um and, and contact kelly at artemis as well who's amazing the whole team at artemis are fabulous they will support you talk this through any information you may want they will send you and but as I said, please, please come and see us at Professional Beauty because it's going to be an amazing show anyway. And it'd be great to meet everybody, catch up, have a chat um, and enjoy those two days. But I said I will be there as well. So if you need anything, I'm more than willing to help you. All right. So thank you so much for listening. And I really hope to see you um, next week, actually. And I will go back afterwards um, and answer any of the questions that that may have been asked in the chat okay thank you so much andrew so yes if you're watching the webinar live or if you've got any questions afterwards just pop some questions into the facebook comments and andrew will answer them for you thank you so much andrew and thank you everyone for joining us today it's my pleasure take care and i'll see you soon bye okay bye bye